Hello everybody, welcome once again to the Horror Vault as we embark on day 13 of the 31 Nights of Horror Challenge. Unsurprisingly, Friday the 13th came and went and I watched Friday the 13th Part 8, Jason May Takes Manhattan. Not everybody's favourite uh, Friday the 13th film, it's one of my favourite uh, Friday the 13th films. Gist of it is, as we all know, Jason ended up in the bottom of the uh, the lake in episode episode in uh, number seven. Um, in this one, there's a bunch of campers going. Well, say campers, there are kids on a boat to go through. They chuck the anchor over, and the anchor cuts open the wire which is running underneath the lake, providing power to the camp. It brings Jason back to life who gets on top of the boat, kills the people that's on the boat, and then that boat sails off towards Manhattan where Jason gets onto another boat and that's where he starts going around killing everybody else that's on that boat before going through Manhattan. So it's really Jason takes two boats before Jason takes Manhattan. And he's not really in Manhattan that long anyway, so but I quite like it. It's got some uh, funny moments in it that I'm sure uh, people who've seen this would know which ones I'm, I'm referring to. There's uh, This is the one with the, the weird ending where Jason uh, is in the sewers of uh, Manhattan and then the toxic waste runs through and it melts him all down and he ends up revealing himself as just the child that sunk at the bottom of Camp Crystal Lake. It's an ending which mixes uh, fans, which is why they don't really rate this one that much. I quite like it. It was doing something different, which is usually a good thing for sequels, especially when it's this late in the stage or when you get into eight. Uh, but then again, fans tend to prefer what they're used to, so trying something different will mix people up. Again, one of my favourite Friday Freddy films is also my favourite franchise of uh, slasher films, so I'm also going to have a bit of love towards this one. Not much more I can say about this because I'm sure. Everybody would have seen uh, the Friday the 13th films. These have been covered on the website in Franchise Corners, which I will leave a link down below for you to check out. And as always, let us know what you think of the Friday the 13th films. Is there any that you would rate higher? Or do you think Jason should have had a better acting? To, say, like Freddy vs. Jason, do you think he, there should have been another one? Jason vs. I don't know. Pinhead or something like that. I know it's been done in the comics, but would you like to have seen a movie of it? As always, like, share, and subscribe. And as I always say, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next video. Bye for now.